National Girlfriend Day cancelled for nationwide protest in Nigeria. Minister Nyesun Wike reacts. August 1st is National Girlfriend Day. While this day might be to celebrate a female lover in Nigeria, it is the day for a planned nationwide protest. The FCT Minister Nyesun Wike described the planned nationwide protest on August 1st as politically motivated. Speaking as reporters on Tuesday, July 23rd, he emphasized the need for patience with the federal government. Miki stated, and I quote, we, If you are engaging in politics, let us be clear about it. If you are being sincere, let us be truly sincere and support our country. The nation is in their state and the new government is trying to make improvement. Expecting a complete turnaround within one year is unrealistic. He pointed out that projects initiated over a decade ago remain incomplete. A new government is not addressing these issues, but demanding immediate results is impractical. The protest is political. He also criticized those who use protests for personal gains, saying some believe they must criticize to stay relevant, especially with elections approaching. These are mere political tactics. The government is serious about solving problems, and we need to be patient for things to improve. If anybody go come talk, now we can be the last person we're supposed to follow us yam. Because you, the way they give advice for your state, you they set that state at least. Yes. You they set this ahem uh, before I go speak to Moritans. You they set fire for the states. You don't care what thing happen. Whether people cry, whether people not cry. So far say you host the progress of river states now you want. Now we can now be the wrong guests if there's anything like wrong guests. Then be the wrongest person to give advice at this point in time. Because you know they take advice. Make you day patient. Make you day patient with who? And if you don't see us use the patient for river states now. Like I said, Wicked is the last person. Eh? He's not even not, not even the last. He's not the right person to come outside and give advice concerning this uh, which they have for inside this Nigeria. They're not supposed to give them as in he no supposed they're not supposed to give a listening ear. I they tell you. That is political, uh, that wanting a complete turnaround. See, nobody is asking for a complete turnaround. But we are also, as we are saying, we are not asking for a complete turnaround. Why would the government be giving themselves complete turnaround? Only the government, they remove subsidy, number one. Number two, they increase their salaries. Number three, they buy SU fees for themselves. Number four, they build us, give VP. All these things that are more new. I don't care if you can't tell me, say, eh, uh, uh, since how many years ago that I did not prove the VPLC, you don't consign me as far as say money from this place, enter that place, money from uh, this thing, enter that place. Now, we say transaction don't happen. Do you understand? Now, we say waiting, transaction don't waiting, don't happen. And then, uh, what is again? You carry money, our money, our head end money, go give people, say they sponsor them, them for hash. As if that's one no day enough. You carry our money, go by private jet, waiting happen. Then you can't come and say when you don't reach up at home. Can't they tell us say eh, eh, make we day patient. Make patience die ten times. Eh? Make thunder fire patience. <laughs> oh God. So see, if you're not going to practice within a pitch, don't even come outside and open your mats and make any nonsense. No miss any kind of rubbish talk. If they come outside, they tell us make we get patience. That the patience, that the process is uh, uh, political. If we like call it political, if we like call it a political, we don't care. We don't care. We don't do anything. We don't care at all. That it is a uh, there. There are mere political tactics. The government is serious about solving problems. They are not serious. If they are serious, they will not be spending our money, buying SUVs, paying for lesser hatch. Buying private jets, that will not be the priority. And building roads that they uh, know that in the next 10 years, they're not going to finish the road. Roads will be saying, me and you know, say this people not going to finish in the next 10 years. Next government, government, they go eat from that road. They go embezzle money. Then they follow us, they argue. No wala. No problem at all. He pointed out that projects initiated over a decade ago remain incomplete. A new government is now addressing these issues. We don't hear which government agrees to address the issue now. Which one? But demanding immediate results is impractical. 
we are demanding immediate result because if you can buy SUV with our money, if you can pay for less with our money, you can pay for what's it called, you can pay for private with our money, then I'm sure that in the space of three months, something can be done. Something can be done. The government is serious about solving problems. We need to be patient for things to improve. Patience. Meanwhile, in order to get patience, if you want to buy a what's it called SUV, in order to get patience, in order to get patience, now they come outside, carry money, go buy a SUV, and I like, buy the color, I beg, I beg, I beg, make nobody vex me. When you don't reach Nigerian town, they go remember, say, he gave it and they call patient. When you reach their own town, quick, quick, in the split, in the split second, they don't approve. If now money where they want take, what they want in Bezu, they don't approve them. You go enter their pockets. If we're engaging in politics, let us, let us be clear about it. If you are being sincere, if we're engaging in politics, at this time, we'll be saying, nah, what's in the happen? Now, governance period. Now you come outside and say if you're engaging in if you're engaging in policies, let us be let us be clear about it. We the follow talk. Let's be truly sincere and support our country. The nation is in a dead state and new government is trying to make more improvements. And you think they are not? You think they are not trying to make improvements? Then yeah. He pointed out projects initiated over a decade will remain incomplete. We are not saying these people. Should not complete whatever, but we are saying start and finish. What you know, say go feed do. A new government is now addressing this issue. Now I go to get. A new government is now addressing the issue now. Now I go waiting. Now I go to get super story. So if the government decide to the. Uh, what's it called? If everybody decide to if everybody can't decide, say okay, they won't uh what's in the call. Nobody won't green call for this country again. Say then go to tell all this guy to where they talk. Eh? They're not gonna tell all this guy to where they tell us now. At the end of the day, my own BC the government, they know what to do. Telling people what to do is not my... I they tell you. You know what to do. You know what to do. All right. At the end of it, they make you busy. I shout on... At the end of the day, make you be say, make these people they call leaders, but they don't come. Go, go together, meet together, give them say better brain. All this nonsense when you talk now, let me then talk. Alright, on this note, you have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for telling in to listen until I come your way next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.